All right guys, so we just landed down in Florida. If you guys remember, we came here last year and we filmed with the first version of this typhoon creation thing. It's uh, two jet skis with a razor built on top. It's like the first thing ever built like it. And uh, this is the second version of it, a little more refined than last time. But today, we all have our own jet skis and we're going down this canal run that has like alligators and a buffaloes and a bunch of other wild things. Sounds Super pretty dangerous. Yeah, it it honestly it does, saying it out loud. Is it alligators or crocodiles? <laughs> alligators, supposedly alligators aren't as- uh, As mean? Yeah, as mean. So don't fall off the jet ski, basically. Yeah, either way, you don't yeah. want to off. Hey, and you guys did have a hand in designing this new one. This is for you. Oh, yeah. Oh, there, hey, there we go. Right. Had you not mentioned the ocean handle, we would not have been Coast Guard certified. Do I get but, a little bit of equity? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Let's go! It's my retirement. <laughs> Look at the truck that's pulling this thing. What is this called? It's the Mega Raptor. It's the F350 on 46 inch tires with this. a custom wide body kit. This actually seems way better Did than the SEMA truck. Oh, you could probably do some stuff with it. Watch how you check the oil. What? Doesn't everybody check their oil like that? <laughs> I'm totally just on the ground. Right. So. <laughs> Are you guys nervous about this at all? I'm excited. You're nervous? I'm not worried. It's just like, you know, you fall off in the water and there's an alligator right there. And Yeah, no. I, I explained it to a few people and they were like, you're what stupid. If, what if you fall off? And I'm like, well, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't plan for that. We're not going to get eaten. You just put that out in the world. It's going to happen. Oh, so I'm going to get eaten. I don't know. These guys don't seem too worried about it. So it makes me feel good. Yeah, but they're Florida, man. Right. We can't even swim. We're from Minnesota. Dude. Ryan was like, don't worry if a gator like attacks or anything. I got my knife. I'm like, a knife? You're going to knife him? Like, what? What'd you say? This is your first time out here? First time out here, man. Why do you avoid it? Alligators. You know, that's not making me feel better. I was telling everyone over there, I was like, I, you know, I feel like I should be worried, but these guys don't seem worried at all. I can't see shit right here. Right? And it's like one foot. That is wild, man. I've never seen anything like it. How many horse? 700. Wow. All the inside turns are real shallow, so try to stay in the middle. There is trees sticking up out of the water. You're supposed to tell me that like, before I get come here. <laughs> You're supposed to tell me that shit before I come out here, not <laughs> now. Gene, don't worry about a thing. Don't Anything worry about that happens to your jet skis, we'll pay for it out of Ken's paycheck. Ken! How far are we going? Uh, about 40 miles. 40 miles? 40 miles. <laughs> I mean, there's like two jets, like really powerful jet streams. Yeah. And I go, I almost get thrown in. And I'm like, God damn it, there's gators in here. The last place I want to be is in the water. But uh, no, this is insane. This is really fun. Pro I mean, easily the most fun I've ever had jet skiing. It's pretty much just like a natural track. And it's really fun too, because like you're going, there's like birds and stuff swooping in front of you, gators and- Every time I see a cr uh, alligator, I just go full. Steve Irwin. I'm every time. Crikey, another gator. <laughs> oh, it's a little one, but you want to keep your distance. 
<laughs> the only other thing is uh, the water honestly tastes like crap. When you get it put on your mouth, like, because you get splashed, you lick your lips, poop water. The one thing I will say, obviously we're not done for the day, but uh, when you say you're going like jet skiing and gator infested water, sounds very dangerous. I, honestly, it's not that dangerous. Hey, I'm just $10 a gallon. Dude, I have no idea what he said. I don't either. It's French. <laughs> On the right. We gotta do the huh? After you pass, they stand a little under the water, and, and after they come up to breathe. Yeah. Right. And when they come up, <laughs> right over. I got one. It was just came up, I two feet, and I can't. So, pop! <laughs> <laughs> I think he'll headache for the rest of the week. Did you hear a bell from that bad? Croissant, bonjour. Oh, 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 You see why we have trust issues? Uh, yeah, I can see that. You don't trust anything. No, hell no, here. man. <laughs> you don't vape, do you? No, I don't. Uh, no. That's good. Can yeah. I swim out there? No, I mean, that's going to be some entertaining shit. So that sounds like it feels a terrible weird, idea. Like I just saw an alligator head right there. No, do not do that. that Bro, what is that? That's, that's a fish. fish. That's a fish? He was saying he paid you 100 bucks. Oh, Your life ain't worth 100 oh, bucks, bro. Holy shit. <laughs> this kid got a death wish? What are, what are you doing? Hey, how deep is it? No! Don't open your mouth! <laughs> Mike's gonna come out looking like an Oompa Loompa, dude. My mind would be f***ing blown if you got attacked by an alligator out there swimming. <laughs> he gets attacked, kick him. Ryan's like, no shit, didn't see that coming. <laughs> mind blowing. All right, guys, brief break in the video today to mention a word from our sponsor, Huel. So if you guys are anything like us, you know how hard it is to find time. Your busy schedule is to eat a proper meal. Next thing you know, you're eating out, something unhealthy, and uh, you're getting fat for the entire internet to roast you by. Luckily, today's sponsor, Huel, is here to help us with a quicker and healthier alternative for food on the go. So Huel is a nutritionally complete meal in a convenient and affordable way. So it provides you with all the carbohydrates, protein, fats, and fibers, and all the 27 essential micronutrients that your body needs to thrive without any artificial sweeteners. So here's how it works. You take your Huel shaker bottle, fill this up to the fill line, which is right there. Also, this is what our fridge looks like. You can see why we need Huel. Now we gotta do two scoops of Black Edition vanilla powder, and then shake it up for about 20 seconds. This is 400 calories, 100% vegan, gluten-free, and uh, about 40 grams of protein. And it tastes good too. Try it out for yourself today by clicking the link in our description and building your own bundle. Thank you, Huel. Now back to the video. I know. <laughs> This is one of those things that I hope looks as fun as it is on camera because it's like constant smiling. I was telling Ryan, these videos get to bring us and have us do a lot of really fun things. And like, this is just one of those things that we would never do if it wasn't for the YouTube videos and you guys honestly watching this. So it's cool to like have these experiences. We got a bunch more planned though. So stay tuned. Cause I think it's gonna just continue to get rowdy. See you next time. Key West next time? He works next With time, sharks. yep. He's not coming back here. I know, I, hell no. <laughs> so uh, Ryan doesn't know this, but we have a professional jet skier coming over with the trick jet skis that you can do backflips on to teach him how to officially land a backflip. So for the past two summers, Ryan has been trying to land a backflip off a wakeboarding boat wave and uh, in the process destroyed his jet ski two times and then ended up just selling it completely. So hopefully today this guy can help him accomplish his goal. It's not his goal, it's more our goal. Yeah, bro, well, yeah, our goal. All right, Ryan, we uh, got someone that we want to introduce you to. Chris? Yeah. How you doing, bro? So this is Ryan. Ryan. Ryan, Chris. Uh, Chris is going to teach you how to officially backflip a jet ski. Oh, 
No. Bro, you gave up on the dream too soon. I run a backflip school here in South Florida. I've been doing this for, doing the school for about six, seven years now. And we have like one person that couldn't do it. So really? I got a good feeling. Oh gosh, you're, I'm gonna be the one fine. who can't. I'm being sick. Good man. Sounds have two. <laughs> if you don't successfully do it today, then it's done. Then it's done. It's gonna be a failed mission. As long as you listen to me and you do what I tell you and hang on, the ski's gonna do all the work. Whoa! So that's what a running stand up sounds like, huh? <laughs> How you feeling? I definitely don't have any excuses now. <laughs> I got the power, yeah, I got the ski, and now I got the trainer. There's no excuses. And a gator pops up and women and freaks out and goes everywhere. I see why all these jet ski riders are in such good shape. Fuck, <laughs> <Lock>, dude. <laughs> I'm sucking in right now too. Anytime I put anything on, Ben immediately is like, you are the funniest looking human being ever. Hey Ev, take a look at the hinder. My God, it's flat. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna chase any gators away for you, all right? Okay, perfect. Um, Just give me a little like, I think, you know, I'm a visual learner. I got you, I know exactly what you mean. Ryan's gonna look like this. Confidence boosting or more intimidating? Equally both, but pretty confidence boosting. I mean, shit, if he's teaching me and I get like 1% of it. Now Alright. If it's not now, it's never, Ryan. Holy fuck, this thing's fast! This thing's fast, dude. It's got one horsepower for each pound. I want this so bad. I might want this more than Ryan. Here we go! In the scale of like students you had, what would you rate Ryan one to ten as far as his potential? I'd say he's a solid six to seven. Like, really? He's, yeah, he's good. You're so close. Why don't you try doing one, land, and then hit the throttle again and go for two? Yeah! You gotta ride it out, you gotta ride it out. He's gotta get the ride out. Yeah, it doesn't really count, I feel like, if you don't ride it out. Chris starts what? getting pissed now. Yeah. Come on, dude, you're just wasting all of our time now. God damn it. We're like the uh, parents of a kid that just doesn't want to play the sport, but the parents just forcing them to do it. Come on, Ryan, you piece of shit. You piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I think I could, yeah, for sure. I have to put you on, dude. This is, this is Ryan's baby. He's got that look in his eye. He's got that look in his eye. He's going psycho.
<laughs> Look at that felt good. <laughs> Let's go, dude. That was lit. Two years in the making. I'm so glad that's over, dude. I can finally like sleep at night now. Ryan, honestly, dude, we all had like so much faith in you towards the end too. I was losing faith. <laughs> We've been out here what an hour? We did it. Stoked. Let's go. I'm so happy. So glad you kept trying, dude. Honestly, it just wouldn't have been the same if you didn't ride out. Shout out Chris. We're gonna link you all of his uh, information down below. If you guys want to learn how to backflip, he's the man for the job. Really? I want to learn. You gotta heal up, Mike. <laughs> and if you're watching this and you think I could have done that in less tries. You can, yeah. you you can, can put try. your money where your mouth is. Yeah. <laughs> Get a hold of me. Yeah. <laughs>